Now, how does stress, anxiety, and depression cause high blood pressure? Now, before we start, it is very important that you understand a little bit about how the body works. Now, your body functions are controlled by two types of nervous system. The first one is called the sympathetic nervous system. And the second one is called the parasympathetic nervous system. The sympathetic nervous system is responsible for the fight or flight response. So it puts you in survival mode. So what activates the sympathetic nervous system? When you are in danger or when your body is under stress, So when you are under stress or when you're in danger, the sympathetic nervous system is activated. And when the sympathetic nervous system is activated, you have an increase in heart rate and an increase in the force of contraction of the heart. So your heart will be beating a lot faster and a lot harder. And that will result in an increase in blood pressure. So another thing that will happen is that you'll be breathing a lot faster. You'll be breathing more shallowly but a lot faster. And that to help you to get more oxygen into your bloodstream. You need oxygen for the muscle to work more efficiently and for your brain to think quicker. Another thing that happens is that you have an increase in blood flow to your brain and an increase in blood flow to your muscles. So when you are an in when you are in a dangerous situation, your brain needs to think very fast and your muscle have to be ready to fight away the danger or to run away. So let's try an example. Let's say you are on your holiday and you go to Africa to see the wildlife. Now after driving for a while, you get out of your car and you do a little bit of stretching. Now suddenly from a distance you see that there's a big lion coming towards you. Now without thinking, your heart rate will go up the roof and you'll be breathing a lot faster and within a split second you know straight away that you have to get back into the car otherwise you'll be eaten by the lion so this is when the sympathetic nervous system is under control so it helps to protect you from the danger it keeps you alive so another thing about the sympathetic nervous system is we have here when you have stress it's activate the sympathetic nervous system but the way that your body interprets stress is different to the way that you interpret stress now the way that we that me or you interpret stress is when we are stressed at work or at home or when we have deadline to meet, when you, we have bills to pay, uh, so that that's is uh, mental stress. But for the body, when your body when your body is um, in danger, when there is harm to your body, it is also considered as stress, and that would activate the sympathetic nervous system. So let's say. Um, you have a problem with your lung and the lung is not working properly the, to get the oxygen that you need so your blood oxygen goes down now your brain needs the oxygen to function properly so when the brain detects that there's a decrease in oxygen level it will stimulate the sympathetic nervous system so that increases the blood pressure when there is an increase in blood pressure the brain get more more blood going through it so it get more oxygen and when the brain gets the oxygen it needs it is happy 
So, another example. Let's say you have an accident and you lost quite a bit of blood. So, when there is a decrease in blood volume, suddenly the brain is not getting the oxygen and other nutrition that it needs to function properly. So what happens? Again, the brain will stimulate the sympathetic nervous system and that increases the blood pressure and that restores the blood flow to the brain. So the brain receives the oxygen it needs to function properly. So, as you can see, the sympathetic nervous system is very important for survival. It acts to keep you alive and it keeps you away from dangerous situations. So when your body increases the blood pressure, the blood pressure go up for a reason. And that's a very important point to, to take in. When your blood pressure go up, it's not because that your body is trying to punish you for not eating healthy or for not exercising. The body is, to, is trying to keep you alive. There is a reason why the blood pressure go up. 